So let's do the funny. What you're looking at right now is an up-to-date version of Windows 11. If you can't tell from the title of this video, I will be attempting to remove or unregister the universal Windows platform UWP applications you see right now on Windows 11. So let me go ahead and do that and organize the window. Alright, now we're gonna go ahead and open up PowerShell. Now for those of you trying to uninstall the useless applications of Windows 10, this may look familiar to you. By typing the command get appx packets followed by remove appx packets. Now what would this do is remove all the applications that are registered on Windows 11. But I did some little tinkering and instead of removing Windows Store applications, it also uninstalls and unregisters the system applications like the settings app, the search, and action center. So I'm just gonna leave this running until something funny happens. And the Microsoft Store app just closed because it has been unregistered. So far, most of the applications are still holding up. Okay, so not only it uninstalled my settings application, but it also uninstalls and unregistered my start menu. I don't know. <laughs> I can't believe that's a thing now, but I just uninstalled my start menu. Oh well. And I find it funny that the critical error my start menu isn't working message doesn't appear 99% of the time that you actually have an issue with that start menu. But yeah, as you can see, all the applications have closed. Um, so let's go in and take a look at the damage. Right off the bat, the setting cap, since it was unregistered, it cannot be found. The timely date doesn't work and apparently my action center has been uninstalled. So, uh, I can't open up search, the widgets thing doesn't work, Microsoft Teams doesn't work, and apparently Microsoft Edge work. Well, not too surprised because the Microsoft Edge is powered by Chromium and it's not even a UWP application. Anyway, at least my Fire Explorer works, so yeah, we got the, the new modern look, I guess. What happens if I open the Fire Explorer app again? Whoa, what did I? Okay. So, if you didn't know, apparently the quote unquote new Fire Explorer is just a UWP app, but I apparently got the old Fire Explorer back. So, um, well, what is Windows 11? I don't know. But the thing is, Windows 11 is just a Windows 10 reskin. There's nothing major new about Windows 11 anyway. So let me go ahead and sign out and sign back in to see if that fixes anything. I wouldn't be too surprised if that actually fixes anything. I have registered most of the, not only the system UWP applications and the Windows Store UWP applications, but I think I kind of made Windows 11 useless. And apparently it's taking a lot longer for me to sign into my account. Which is a really, really bad sign. So I get, oh, whoa. Uh, so I got the old taskbar? Wait a minute, this is Windows 11, right? Windows 11 should have the new taskbar. But why do I have the Windows 10? What? Oh, not all. Oh. Beautiful. My file explorer app doesn't even work at all. Nice. So you're telling me Windows 11 is a joke. But now I need to use this infamous way to get through the file explorer, which is the, through the control panel app. But what I was about to say is, this is... I can't fathom. Like, this is Windows 11. And yet, this is Windows 10. Like, I mean... And secondly, my start menu is not even running, and my search app is not even running, so I uninstalled both of them. Which is, yeah, I did the funny. To make matters even worse, the search bar doesn't work on File Explorer anymore because I unregistered the search application. So, yeah, I can't use the search bar on the File Explorer anymore. And I have to restart using the old File Explorer. Okay, thank you Explorer for pressing, but you just have to use the control panel way of Fire Explorer. And 
even on the cell apps folder we don't see all or most of the uwp applications anymore because well i unregistered it and uninstalled it the only thing that remains is the quick assist yeah and apparently ms settings failed to launch because the package failed to update so well the only thing i have left is to restart the virtual machine so let's go ahead and do that So, yeah, even restoring the virtual machine didn't fix anything. Um, Fire Explorer is broken. Uh, my start menu doesn't work anymore. And, well, I now got a... Probably a door stopper. And yes, I got the old version of Microsoft Paint and the good old notepad. So, yeah, that's what happens when you unregister the UWP application on Windows 11. You pretty much get a door stopper. Thanks for watching.